Hello everybody, uh, Tarn here again with more Red Dead Redemption 2. Uh, apologies for being a wee bit quiet there at the beginning, I was just trying to get some uh, some stuff um, up and ready, so yeah, yeah. But I hope everybody is having a, a good day so far. Mine is fairly quiet, I would say. Um, yeah, not not much. It's been happening so far. Um, just, just chilling. Um, I'll be heading back to college soon. Um, our break finishes up on Monday, so back to the back to the drawing board. Um, but yeah, um, yeah, just been a been a fairly chill time. I've I've not done much. Aside from do some studying work, but um, that being said, welcome. <laughs> I bit delayed there trying to think what I was gonna say. Um, I'm a bit scatterbrained, so apologies in advance. But yeah, um, I need to think my intros better. <laughs> but hi, um, uh, for all those coming in, um, I'm Tartan. I'm a variety streamer. And I'm currently playing through Red Dead Redemption 2. This is technically... This is not my first play. <laughs> this is not my first play of the game. I've played it half a dozen times now. Um, this is my second time live streaming it and doing a let's play of it. Um, I originally did my first original let's play over on the Around the Campfire podcast channel. Which is... a uh, a gaming channel that me and my friends started up during the first lockdown. Um, if you haven't checked out Around the Campfire podcast, I highly recommend. Um, my friends put out really good content. Um, it's basically it's the channel where I started doing live streams, really. Um, and now I'm trying to do my own wee thing, should I say. But yeah, plan for today... Now, we do have a main story mission. I'm currently in San Denis, but I'll explain why in a minute. Um, but yeah, <coughs> there's a story mission here. Country Pursuits. Dutch needs to speak to you. Now, but that picture there, I think most people that have played this game know what that mission is. But for those that don't... It's not a crocodile, it's an alligator, should I say. Giant fucking alligator. But yeah, um, because I want to do that mission first, because then after doing that mission, it unlocks one of the legendary animals, that being the giant alligator. Because um, I want to try and get as many of the legendary animals and fish as possible today. Um, without giving too many spoilers away. Um, yeah, certain certain parts of the map are currently locked out at the moment, so I won't be able to get all of them. Um, and I think I also want to try and get some of the some of the rock carvings because if I remember, there's twelve. And I've I've completed that side task before. The legendary animals. Now, I'll bring your attention to here, San Denis, Why all these little markers are up? You remember how I said I've never found the vampire in this game? Well, I want to track down the vampire. And I think they say that there's at least five clues that indicate where the... Where it basically tells you where the vampire is. Um, but yeah, I think these are some of the, the main ones here. And that that one's not linked with the vampire. That's a, that's a different thing. I think that's the... Oh, it's a mugging encounter that I'm curious to get because there's two mugging encounters you can get in Saint Denis, and apparently this one here, um, you can get your money back because there's one of the encounters where they rob you blind and you don't get your shit back, and uh, I almost got I almost got lured into that or that first one. Um, that guy l lingers about the gunsmith at night. Now this guy is a different one, it's down by like the the waterfront, so 
Hi, Kiel. How are you doing? Me and Diggle are gonna go hunting for a vampire. Or at least try to, because I've never found a vampire in this game before. Some things. That's what Ball happens when that's what happens when I take my eye off things. Is is someone there? Anything to spare for a blind man? Fine, I'll do it. There you go, oh, friend. bless you, mister. Truly, you're a saint. <laughs> yes, sir, there should be more people in the world like you. God bless. Okay. Oh, that's good to hear, Q. What? I know you and, uh... Some good I know you and Sarah have just started up a business. And speaking of Sarah... Hi, Sarah. It's my wife, who... We're waifus in Cult of the Lamb. <laughs> I'm... Sarah, 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 Sarah. I'm trying to do my Dean Winchester voice. <clears throat> you can be saving people and hunting things. The family business. That's my shit impression of Dean Winchester. But yeah. To, um, yeah. We're, g we're gonna be tracking down the, the Saint Denis vampire first. Before we do the giant alligator mission. And then legendary animals and fish. But there's a way of going about the the vampire apparently. You got a problem with me? I don't have a problem with you, yo crow. Let's see, the thing with all these Alright. I'll go to this one first, because it's by the, the shitty saloon that's got all the rats in it. Yeah. But they say you, you have to look out for writings on the wall. And as you can see, just through there... I drink from the maiden and I live again in the dead. The heart of the ring of blood. Ooh. Okay, so I could take that marker down. Um go down to the next one. So it's not too far away. Dougal, where are you? Oop. I hate Sandini. Everybody just walks out in front of you. We'll go to bloody jaywalkers, that's what they are. Now, is this guy... No. No. Still not here. I don't know how I, how I can trigger that. But... Mm, it's not really essential, so... Now. Next one... They say on the video that I caught. Joseph. So you can't really see it that well. well then. That's why I used a, a guide. <laughs> That's why I used the guide. I mean, I, I, I can't even see that. I feed again the blood of life. The circle has begun. What, the circle of life? Man, is this, this guy been watching Lion King again? <laughs> uh, ooh, ooh, hang on. Is there a way of doing it? I think there is a way of doing it. Um, I just need to consult, consult the guide, consult the guide. Um. Right. 
Right. Okay, so it's it is this one. Down here by the butcher and the general store. Do you never work? One name is Boy. Morning to you. Five bones under the perfect star. Nosferatu with Dominica will become mortal again. Man, this guy's a crackpot. It's <laughs> just... Uh, ooh. Wait. Hang on. Just consulting the video. Apologies. So it's this one here. So you getting along okay? Hey there, friend. How can I help? Do you need some plan? Just down this way. Ooh, don't run in front of a horse. Um. Hey, you good? Oh, the son of a bitch. I'm just looking for a vampire. I'm doing the town of service here. Ignorant books. Oh, sweetest of napes. May your blood remain forever on my lips. Six there will be before the lust is sated. Alright. And the last one. Up here. Hey, Dougal, what are you doing? God's sake, Dougal. Oh, fuck's sake, you're blocking the way, Dougal. 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 Yep, yep. Move. Move your arse. Come on. <laughs> Stupid arse. Come on. <sighs> Come on. Block it. <laughs> uh. Dougal, you're testing my patience. Let's get. Oh, God, that dumb, that dumbass horse. Dougal's not right. Oh, I'm. Just... Why, why, Dougal? Why? Just. Oh, why are you this way? Hello there. <sighs> Damn it. Tend to do that. Oh, 
Me? Y'all talking about me? all the knocks to the head that I've done him in they'll kill <laughs> poor Diggle <laughs> right I'm consulting the guide again Just so I can get an idea where the location is. I've probably walked past it. Watch me having walked past it. Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> I walked past it. It was staring me right in the face. It was staring me right in the face. But I couldn't see it. <laughs> Right. With one long kiss, I draw the life from her and await the outpost of advancing day. Hmm. Now, I think what you have to do after that, because I think that's where it is, this little alcove here. Yeah, so I think we have to come back. We have to come back here at night time. <clears throat> Cause we we gonna go kill this vampire. He's 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 been a menace. There's there's only one menace in Saint Denis, and that's me. So I'm not have I'm not having somebody on my turf. Oh no. Dead end. Ah. Oh, get out of here. <sighs> sorry! Ow, I'm so sorry! <laughs> so sorry! I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to do that. I'm just, I'm, I'm lost. You see? I didn't... Fuck's sake. I'm being a menace. I can't find my way out. Where? Freedom. Yes. Just don't judge me for that, okay? Greetings. <laughs> Good to see you. Mail. Where have I got mail from? Hmm. <clears throat> oh god, look at all that. Right, let's see. <clears throat> I'm gonna try and do my best impression of Charles Chatonnier. Mon cher ami, I made it. I have the sun in my face, sand between my toes, and a beautiful vagina in my bed. Where you find a station, you'll find a lot of trouble. You get a lot uh -huh. of visitors coming in and out of this place, you know. Yeah. Okay. 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 I get it. I I need to find somewhere peaceful that I can do this. Because buttholes are just gonna keep interrupting me. Yeah, 
I'm gonna I'm gonna like retire to a hotel room so I can read it in peace. Read it on the street, I'm just gonna get harassed by people. With you. Your right. You hang tight, Dougal. Oh yeah, Sarah. Yeah, definitely. Arthur. Arthur does need a bath. Hey, move. Hmm. Just right, I All think. Right. Can nice someone to see. bring me something to eat? Monsieur, something light and refreshing, like cocaine on toast. Damn. <laughs> side of despair. Well, how about a side of beef? Because, uh, you know, Arthur's a big side of beef. Ma'am? Just what exactly are we doing alive? It's a mystery to me. No mistake. You got any ideas, big man? No, not really. Well, at least you're honest. <laughs> All my life I've been surrounded by morons claiming to know the answer to that question. Liars. Bloody lot. Narcissi, all of them. It's the great American sickness, vanity. I'm very drunk. Yeah, I, I can tell. Hen, you need to lay off the coke. Where is that little shit? Tommy, How darling, you where are you? Bartender. I can't believe that at the trial Prime station. Rib, please. They the reckon at least 20 police were killed. Oh, yeah, yeah, I wouldn't know about that robbery. I, I didn't rob the trolley station. Are you talking to me? Because my name isn't Tom. Good meal, I hope. Yeah, I, I didn't rob the trolley station. I... I I, I resent that. That's that's here. That's hearsay. Okay. I object. That's just hearsay. <laughs> I think my neighbor's out mowing their lawn because I just hear this brrrr in the background. Kind of distract. <laughs> ah. Can I assist you in there, sir? Hmm. Nah. I think I'm okay. Thanks. All right. Suit yourself, sweetheart. See the benefits of doing this, other than you know, seeing a bit of thirsty beef. It ups his stamina. <laughs> yeah, just what Arthur needs while he's bathing the sound of grass cutting. I mean, it could be worse. They could be screaming at each other. So that's happened. Not, not when I've been on stream, mind you, but, you know. Right. Can I sit? How are you, my love? I'm gonna sit and I'm gonna read the letter. At least Charles Chatney's one, anyway. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> Mon cher ami, I made it. I have the sun in my face, sand between my toes, and a beautiful vagina in my bed. The islands are everything I thought they would be, and more. You would not believe the light, and the colors, and the people here. So much brighter and more alive than anything or anyone in San Denis. It feels like a world away, which of course it is. 
you may be surprised, but you are my only true friend from those dark, dreary days. You did not ask for anything. You only gave. A perfect, a rare, a detest selfish asses more than civilization itself. But what is civilization really but an organized selfishness? I must constrain my utmost primal and vital desires so you may be comfortable. Pa, no merci. This island paradise is what the civilized world would call primitive. But the people here are the most generous. In ways, I mean not put into words, I have met. Why is this? Because they are free. I have never painted like I paint now. It is work the likes of which I have never seen. Have never been seen. Before I sent this, I shipped some canvases to New York to be sold. Perhaps if you own that little scribble, it may be worth something now. Either that, or laugh at my in ineptitude. Always yours. CC. <laughs> that voice. Jesus. <coughs> That's like one of my favorite lines from him in the game. Like Buddha says, you know, we are all here to fuck. <laughs> and then that wife is just like clutching our perils like, Oh my god, you can't just say such vulgar things. Yeah, and that's just the... Because we wrapped up the, the Gunslinger mission, so that's the guy that was writing the book. Just saying, oh, thanks for helping, here's the money. Where's the one from the mayor? June 1899, from the office of Jean-Marc Mercier, mayor of Saint-Denis. Ooh, now Jean-Marc is the mayor now, is he? Dear Mr. Kilgore, these are troubling times at City Hall with the resignation of Mayor Lemieux, but civic business continues. The new mayor has asked, you, has asked that you be formally commended for your recent services to the city of Saint-Denis. Please accept this token of the gratitude of the citizenry, along with a personal message from the mayor. The scandal will pass and we will be stronger than ever. Yours respectfully, the office of the mayor of Saint Denis. <coughs> okay. So I think I'm gonna go to sleep. We gotta go to sleep and then we go track down that vampire. And probably get killed by the vampire. <laughs> Cause they say the vi like the vampire you have to be really quick on the trigger. Because he moves at lightning speed. I just want that fancy dagger that you get off him. This. Ah. Hey. Either way, missus. The goal keeps on calling on me while Edouard is out. I reach a kick and you don't want to give me one solo steam. So, so I put a parade on me. Ain't got me scared. Oh, wait. Kiss Hang on. Certainly. I want. A whiskey for courage. You be making you choice sometimes. Can I can I get a whiskey? I'm gonna go kill a vampire. Yeah. Or it's gonna kill me. I don't know which. Both. You have an itch need scratching? Oh no. You give me the itch. Oh, I remember you. I hope you took my advice and forgot all about that matter that you were inquiring on when you were last in here. For sure. I know when to leave something well alone. Good. Well, let me know if you need anything. Okay. We don't yeah. need to do much talking. Bonjour. All right. Now. I'm not quick on the draw at all. <laughs> I mean, I know there's one bounty that you can go get up around the strawberry area 
Um, and he... <laughs> he's very, very quick on the draw. Right. Where is he? Where is he? Have I done it wrong? Because it's here. You find him down here. A bit in confession. Is that what you've been doing? Hello there. Hmm. Oh, that's weird. Well. <coughs> Oh dear. <clears throat> but choke there, Jesus. <coughs> Can anybody show me some kindness? Please. You. Yes. Please. Coins, please. Please. But won't you lend a coin to a fella in need? <coughs> Go get yourself some to eat. Sir. I want you to have this. Thanks, friend. It's nice to give something instead of just begging. Yeah, that's true. I hate asking hmm. for money like a goddamn worm. The problem here is dirt. I may have to sleep. Hey there, mister. You're yeah, welcome okay. back, but I can't tolerate any more nonsense. The longer you play, the more people aim for keeps. If you get me. Uh, what, what do you have? Uh, the room's still there. Um. <clears throat> Care to have some fun? Yeah, thank you. You're not Charles Smith, so I'm not interested. Sorry, what? <laughs> yeah, I ship them. I ship Arthur and Charles. See if this works, because sometimes I know I think you have to wait a few days or something. Unless I'm looking in the wrong area, because I know I know I'm not looking in the wrong area. Want to sleep with me? Don't you look no. How you keep it? Very well, thank you. Everyone wants Arthur's booty. Just <laughs> leave the man alone. Jeez. See, I like the more open spaces in this game. Like when you've got like a lot of the, like a lot of the landscape, I I love going around, like the strawberry part of the map, like West Elizabeth. I would say that's my favourite part of the map. All these people congregating at the stairs, get out of my way! Hey. Don't you see? I'm trying to fight a vampire. This will do for me nicely. Be well. Hello there. Out of the damn way. Excusez-moi. <laughs> I'll try again. Hmm. 
Yeah, yeah, here it is. Because I see the X on the map. There he is. So, you found me. It's the vampire. <laughs> Hi, Chris. <laughs> Just found the vampire. Hey, what are you doing? Don't get close, Arthur. Stay back for your own sake. I walk with the undead. <laughs> what, you're a vampire? I have been called many names over the centuries. Now go, or I'll feed on you too. <laughs> Bro, you wish. You're a goddamn idiot. I'll suck you dry. Come on. Boom. Boy, you dead. <laughs> Ooh. Two bat wings. Two bat wings and a knife. Poor bastard. Oh well, we did it. Okay. Okay, fella. Good God. Why are you doing this? Oh, Christ. Oh my God, they're dead. It's a vampire. It's fine. It's fine. Whoa. Just put him on consecrated ground. He should burn. Don't pull him off at the church. Knock, knock. Father, sister, get a present. There you go. No lovely present for the church. Wake up in the morning. Like, oh my god, there's a vampire on the doorstep. <clears throat> Funny how nobody was like screaming and be like, oh my god, murder. Right. Now, let's go back to camp. Like, hey Arthur, what have you been doing on your travels? Well, I killed a vampire. You can see where I'm going. Right. So how's your weekend being, Chris? What's your problem? Mine's has been fairly quiet. The October breaks are just about to finish up, so I'm back in class on Tuesday. It's been a fairly chill two weeks, but you know, back to back to the studies. Is that the cat for that, Dougal? Yeah. Yeah, because I want to do the giant alligator mission, because then that opens that up as a legendary animal. Um, and then go about and try to find some of the legendary animals and fish. 
You don't really get anything out of the legendary animals aside from like aesthetic things. Um, <coughs> but the fish, the the one, the legendary fish, that is a side quest. And I've never completed that, but again, a lot of the legendary stuff is like region locked up until a certain point. Which is kind of yeah. a shame, but hey, you know, hey, it's me. It's me. Look who's Easy now. All right, folks, calm down. Daddy's home. Don't make the bat things. Good job, Mr. Morgan. Might not be the best, Martha. but you know. Come up here. Yeah, in a minute, Dutch. <clears throat> yeah, you know, you know what rock stars like with their um, their Easter eggs. Hello. Hello. Oh, don't pour the coffee. Stew. What stew? I want some of the shitty stew. Yeah, I've heard of the Butcher's Creek one. Um, I don't usually hang about. In a minute, Dutch! I'm having my dinner! Needy bitch. Oh, and here's another bitch. Hello, Micah. I have to just throw the bullet, bullet at your head. Mr. Bell. Are you joining us, Morgan? At least say it like you mean it. How many times are you gonna say hello? Get up here already! See? I'ma punt you off that balcony, Dutch. You sass me one more time. How are you? I can't complain. Glad to hear it. She was as gratitude I get in this camp. I mean, look at that. Uncle just... Ugh. Fucking bums. A lot of them. Oh, I need to update the ledger. Oh, Arthur, you get the deciding vote. By what? We take an insult and scurry off like cockroaches? Or deal with business the right way? We don't need to take revenge. We hardly know the guy. This ain't about revenge, Hosea. Angelo Bronte don't mean shit to me. This is about the fact we are planning to rob a bank in his town. A bank that he no doubt protects. A town where his men are gunning for us. Before we do that, we need to put him I out of commission. I disagree. There's always an easier way. There ain't no easier way. Now, I know his type. He is a vindictive little power broker who rules by fear. Now, we pull that stunt in his cesspit of a town. We're doomed. You want to leave this place? Leave this country? We need that money. 
just don't feel good Dutch. This is it. Listen to this is the last job that we are ever gonna pull. Mm -hmm. Before the year is out, we are gonna be harvesting mangoes in Tahiti. Oh. Farmers. But we need seed capital, and we need to leave. Yes. You know it. I know it. Forgive me if I can't think too much about the mango harvest. This is I'm... it. <laughs> Trust me. Arthur. If no. it's business, well. Oh, Jose Alert. Look at Jose. This is his business. Angelo Bronte stands between us and our future. You'll damn us all. Huh? Arthur, come on. I can't. can't. You better be right about this one. <laughs> I oh. am. You tell like Jose was like. I've heard that before. <coughs> and usually I've been right. Uh -huh. uh, if you say so. Quit doubting, Arthur. It does no favor. Don't sass me, Dutch. Come on. Don't, don't do that. Go see a man about a boat. Don't fucking gaslight me. A boat? We're headed to a settlement called Le Gras. I met a boatman there called Thomas who knows these waters like the back of his hand. Why do we need a boat? So we can attack Bronte's mansion from the swamp. Catch him off guard. He knows we survived the trolley station, so he'll be expecting some kind of reprisal. All right. Okay, makes sense. See, I do still possess some capacity for rational thought, Arthur. Don't sass me. What is your problem? Just listen to Jose. You could tell okay, like Art. Follow me. You could tell Jose was like, "Oh, listen to me. Don't take his side." Yeah, there should have been a choice, Chris. Thank you. For what? For taking my side back there. It ain't about sides. Feels like Jose has lost his spine. Don't talk about Jose like that. Let's move on Bronte. Is it for the bank job or revenge for what happened at the trolley station? Both. Neither. What does it matter? We need to hit that bank. And Bronte has the police and just about everything else in San Denis in his back pocket. He also set us up. And lest we forget, took young Jack. I understand. We just got a lot of pots on the boil, given all the folks who's out gunning for us. You all seem to have forgotten how money is made and what it takes to support 20 people. Let alone what it takes to give 20 people a new life overseas. That's, that's your idea. With all due respect, Dutch. Is this Tahiti plan really gonna work out? Nah. You tell me, Arthur. Is it? No, it's gonna sink. Have some goddamn faith. I am bending over backwards to make a future for us. I know, but 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 when did you become so small-minded? Hey, that's about. Would rather we break up the family, go our separate ways. Oh, don't way. gaslight. Just tell me. Don't gaslight. Of course not. This isn't a prison camp. I am not forcing anybody to stay. Really? So either we're in this together, working together to get out together, or we're not. There simply isn't a reality in which we do nothing and get everything. I know. You're right. It just feels like we're on borrowed time again. I mean, the old Driscoll's found us. Yeah, we need to move, and soon. Haven't I made that clear? I feel like I'm going in circles with all of you. Micah is the only one left hey. with any loyalty. Ah, uh, that ain't fair. You are talking like John. I, I swear that woman no. is poisoning him against me. I've seen it before. What's the problem here? Yeah. There ain't a problem. You think Micah would question going after Bronte? No. He'd say, let's go. I'm here, ain't I? I've been at your side for 20 years. Yeah. I know. I... Gob now, aren't you? I... I'm Dick. sorry, son. Don't call me that. It's just <laughs> the endless debate about everything is wearing me down. The others, I can take. But when you're not behind me, don't guilt trip. It hurts. Don't guilt trip me. Blackwater. Valentine. 
Rose. Sean. Kieran. I promise. None of it will be in vain. We are going to make it. I know we will. And see, I have a love-hate relationship with Dutch. I like, I like, I think he's a fascinating character, but at the same time, I, I fucking hate him. I'm like, but his behavior and his actions, and just, uh but he's a fascinating character. I know I said to Benjamin Here Byron Davis, he's, <clears throat> he's very much like a Shakespeare antagonist. Oh, there's that fucking goat that hates me. Thomas. It is good to see you, my friend. Hello, Mr. Oh. Dutch. Thomas, have you met Arthur? Arthur? Thomas is quite the boatman. He's going to help us <laughs> get close to our prey. The other night, we're in a big, had thick jacket in the swamps. Fishing for catfish. Now, my friend. Can I call in that favor? What do you need? You know Angelo Bronte. Well, exactly. We need to make a social call. We were hoping you could row us in quietly one evening around the back of his house. Well, if anyone can, I can. We'll pay you for your trouble. If you're bringing him trouble, it won't be no trouble for me. Good. My business partner, Jules, he's out on the skiff. I need to check with him. Plus, I need to check the traps. Would you come with me? Of course. Arthur? Why not? Shouldn't take too long if we can find it. He lived. Mind you, there's a lot of gators. Uncommon number. Big ones. Great. Ah. Come now, Arthur. It'll take more than a prehistoric reptile to scare you, Shirley. I just want to see you meet your match when it comes to a, an aging predator with a big mouth, Dutch. Arthur here is something of a comedian, Thomas. More of a jester than a gunslinger. Well, if you say so, Mr. Dutch. This way. Come on, this way. Follow me here. And stay on the high ground. You call this ground? It feels like water to me. Down here, we can't be too picky there, Mr. Arthur. Got a couple of crayfish traps up ahead. This mission just gives me the creeps. <laughs> Arthur with his big, big jacket on. <laughs> I didn't think Mr. it would Dutch, automatically go into out. a cutscene. Mr. Arthur, check the traps with me. For God's sake. Eh. Can you please check the other one for me, Mr. Arthur? I'm doing it. I'm doing it. This one's empty. All right. I got a few more set over this way. Come on. I don't want to know what just touched my leg. Mr. Dutch, you show you the right fellas to be going after Angelo Brunton? Oh, he's much more the kind of reptile I can handle. Now stay close. Make sure you follow my line. Oh, I fully intend to, Thomas. You too, Mr. Arthur. You can see why even in swamp waiting hasn't caught on as a pastime, can't you? I love it out here. Peaceful. Nobody bothering you now. Except for the night folk sometimes. The night folk? Yep, some strange people around these parts. Wilder than the animals they are. Well, this just gets better and better. It's like our head cannon Dutch has been very squeamish. So him wading through the swamp water, he'd be thinking, ooh. Whoa. Stop where you are. That's a gator. Just stay as still as you can. Where? Oh, there. 
Oh, I hate the swamps in this game. I'm still better about the last stream I did. I lost a perfectly good pelt. I'm still better about that. I got trap by that small island up here. I don't know what's taking Jules so long with that boat. I think we are all equally keen to find him. This trap stuck in the mud. Uh, it happens. Uh. Ooh. Guess something didn't want to be caught. My God. So it's true. What is? There's been talk of a big old bull, but people talk a lot of nonsense. I guess this was... No, but only some huge could do this. Oh, fantastic. Let's hope it bites you first, Dutch. Should we just keep moving? I don't really want to hang around here much longer. I... I suppose this can wait. No. I wouldn't be doing that either, Chris. I would be waiting about in the swamp as well. For one, I would drown. <clears throat> and also, I wouldn't want to know the things you would probably catch in the swamp water. And also, alligators just... No. My God, there's no shortage of them. Good eating. Us or them? Exactly. Come on. This was, if I get eaten Dutch, this was your idea. We really should have run into jewels by now. I reckon we should split up so we can search both sides. Let's okay. don't. Arthur, since you appear so at home here, you take the right. Well, I want to take the left. left. What? But just keep your eyes open. But why do I have to take the right? Let's not split up. Have you never seen horror films? For fuck's sake. Eh. Fine. I go. I go to the right. I swear to God, I get eaten. Someone there? No. Jules. No. Jules. No. <laughs> exactly, Q. If Arthur was any shorter in the swamp. Oh, there's a light. Be Jules. Yes. Where is the boat? Over there. I ran. I. Oh. God okay. Yeah. And uh, where'd this monster swim off to? I 
think that way. I got the skill. It's over here. <laughs> Stop. Come. Good man. All right. Let's get back to the dock. Yes, please. Let's go. Thank God. So, uh... What are these fellas, Thomas? Two new friends of mine. I'll explain later. Jules, we are very happy to have finally made your acquaintance. I thought I was gonna be out here all night. What you doing hiding up in the tree, boy? This gator was huge, Thomas. Twice as big as I ever seen. Twice as angry, too. Oh. Now, boy, I think we hit a tree stump. Yeah, I thought we cleared. You're gonna need to jump in and pull us free. Me? Yeah, just do it. Won't take you a minute, boy. Go on. This is a bad idea. <laughs> we'll see any giant monster <laughs> long before it gets anywhere near you. Got a couple crack gunslingers here with the guns loaded. You'll be fine. You didn't see the thing. Yeah, neither did you. It's just a myth, Jules. Now pull. 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 Oh. Jules? Shit. He won't kill No, I'm going in. No, no, we can't lose the boat. Arthur will go. What? Fuck. Oh, God damn it, Dutch. I love, I love how quick Dutch was there. It's like, Arthur will do it. My leg. I'm doing it, Dutch. I'm going out. If I get eaten, I swear to fucking God. I'm coming! I'm coming, Jules! Come here, son! No! Shit! Where'd he go? Jules! Where'd you go? Huh? Why can't. See. behind this music's giving me anxiety I wanna do something. I w <laughs> like one of the funniest parts in this mission. I want I wanna test something. I wanna see <laughs> for any of them that's not seen this. Down by the alligator. 
I think he's going. Your boy doesn't look too good there. Here, take this. Try to stop the bleeding. You're gonna be okay, son. You're gonna be okay. Just thank your old Uncle Dutch. I heard that. You're supposed to. This is your fault. There's still a lot of blood. You need to put pressure on it. That's what I'm doing. You don't. St are you not watching me, Dutch? <clears throat> I've stopped the bleeding. I think he'll be okay if he don't get a fever. We can bring down a fever. A fever is the least of our worries. Look who's back. God damn it. <laughs> I don't want to try this again. <laughs> I need, I need this. I need. <coughs> you see him? Shoot. You well, you're doing a good job. You're doing a good job. Just, it's fine. It's fine. Yoink! <laughs> oh, I shouldn't laugh. Oh, fuck. For sake. Oh, God. Oh. It's one of the most unintentionally funny things. Having the snout. Bolster. There's still a lot of blood. Oh, you, you clipped that kill. <laughs> you clipped it. Which one? Arthur getting eaten or Dutch? Because <laughs> the one with the, is, the one where is Dutch getting eaten by the alligator okay. is hilarious. If you don't get a fever, <sighs> we can bring down a fever. <laughs> A fever is the oh, least of all worries. Oh God! Look who's back! God damn it! He oh, wants second helpings. Jules, guess all them stories was true. Big and bad. That's unusual. Normally the little one's angry. Big one's is lazy. Well, I guess he never outgrew his anger. Kind of reminds me of you, Arthur. You know, I don't think I've ever seen you squeal before, Dutch. <laughs> I weren't the one squealing. Yeah, well, you weren't in the water with him. And this poor boy was nearly dinner. Can we get some help? Jules the Dutch was dinner. Uh, oh, my God. There's a monster out here. <clears throat> He's been bitten, but he's alive. Uh, Just keep him warm. Feed him garlic for the infection. Thank you. Both of you. I'm at your service anytime you need. Thank you, Thomas. 
Where can we find you? You just meet me back here. Very good. Can one of you help me put the boat back out? Sure. I'm gonna head back to camp and placate the irritable Miss O'Shea, who's causing more trouble. I'll collect the boys. Meet you back here, Arthur. <clears throat> Mr. Arthur? <clears throat> Old Bronte. Bad <clears throat> man. I know. Killed some good folks. Hurt a lot of people. Well, he definitely lacks a certain charm. I'll see you soon. You be safe. You got monsters out here. <clears throat> well... Oh, <coughs> there's nothing funnier than seeing Dutch getting eaten by an alligator, though. Just <laughs> glorious. Right now, if I remember, Let's see, there is a legendary fish that's around, <coughs> around here, so we can get that one first. So I need to actually consult my guidebook for the animals. Hi, Retrack. You just missed Dutch getting eaten by an alligator. Mm. Okay, I'm just trying to... Right. <clears throat> right, so there's a boar, legendary boar. I think around about, around about this way. We're gonna put the waypoint there. Um, yep. We're relatively close by. Yeah, but retract. You've not, you've not missed a lot. Um, you better but watch, watch that those parts back. Um, but we got the Sandini vampire, and we've just done the giant alligator mission. And now we're just gonna go <coughs> and look for some of the legendary animals and fish. Now I can't guarantee it's gonna be all of them. Um, I know a fair bit is region locked. No, he didn't have a plan for the alligator attack. <laughs> Yeah. 
Oh. I thought I almost fudged that there. I haven't caught the legendary panther before. Um, I think they say you have to catch at least yeah. like all the legendary animals before you can get access to it. Because I think for some of them there's like a criteria that you have to kind of follow in order to trigger it. At least I think that's how it goes. wandering about this area because I'm not entirely sure where on the map it is but I know it's around around this way I know it's around the marsh area if I'm unsure I will consult a guide because my guidebook whilst it's handy it's quite limited on it doesn't give the exact location which is kind of unfortunate mm. right so I'm right it is in the marsh in the marsh area Okay, I'm consulting a guide on well, the, the video, um, well, the channel that I usually use for the for the for the guides is GTA series videos. They've got a really good set of um, set of guides um, for like a lot of the Red Dead's kind of additional content, like the rock carvings, the dream catchers, the legendary fish, animals. It was their video that I was using for the um, Aldrin and Wasp mission, um, which was really handy because it gives you like a, it pinpoints the exact location on the map, like where you're meant to go. Um, and the guidebook doesn't really give you a clear picture of where it is you're meant to be or where you're meant to look. <coughs> I'm also like a very much a, a visual, a visual person, so I have to physically see it rather than reading, reading it. So if I see a video that you know shows the, shows the location clearly, um, it gives me an idea of where where to look. Especially if there's like anything recognizable about the the area, like if, if there's like a fallen tree or a building or you know, anything unusual. Right. Here we are. Oh god, don't put, point the thing at Dougal. Right. You stay here, Dougal. I've not hunted down any of the legendary animals in ages. Here we are. Pig shit. I better get moving. I know one of the leg one of the legendary animals. In fact, there was two that I can think of that were absolute pigs in the ass to find. It was the coyote and the um, fox. That was just a pain, an absolute pain to find.
through the ways. You see, there's like some of the legendary animals that are not too difficult to, to track down. Um, but then there's some that are like just annoying to track down. I've never actually got the legendary mist before. I've got I've got the bee I've I've got the beaver beaver before. The legendary wolf is fairly fairly easy to get hold of. I reckon. Same with the deer and the bear. Um the fox, because it's like in and about the it's in and about the trees and it's an absolute pain in the ass. Yeah, I did it. Yeah, got my first legendary animal. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> it's too bad, isn't it? <laughs> See, there's some of the legendary animals that I remember where they are. Like, run about the location where they are. I know they say the... The, the, bi the legendary bison up in the mountains can be quite tricky to find. Because <coughs> it's like a bright white... It's got bright white fur and it's out in the snow, so... Okay, let's see. This is the closest one. Um, well, we're on this side of the map, so I suppose we can. Go for the beaver. Let's go for the legendary beaver because we're not too we're not too far away. That's like the closest one. Um, yeah. Alright, I just need to check my stats. More likely Dougal stats. It's fine. So I'm thinking we go for the beaver and then the moose. There's a, there's a trapper round about this way as well. Um, so we would be able to unload the pelts there. And then I think easy, easy. after we've tried those, because um, the legendary moose is around about this way, 
So then we can like come round and then we can like go for the bear. Chicken shit of a horse. Won't be marked on the map. Oh yeah. Oh god. You. Oh yeah. I found some of the the trail trees. Aha. Uh -huh. Why are you ahead of me? Must be a way off. Okay, where are you? Oh, I think I see it. I see it. Yay, got it. What? Ah! Arthur. Yeah. No. <laughs> oh. God's sake, Arthur. Chris, I could have lassoed it. <laughs> but I I like to I like to complicate things for myself. There you go, come on.
Come on. I think what we'll do before we go to get the beaver, we'll go to the trapper so we can unload. <coughs> Unload these pelts that we've got so far so that we don't lose any. Because I'm guessing the beaver, is, that'll be a big pelt, so. Yep. Yeah. So far, forget how many in total of legendary animals there is. Because I think they say once you've got all of the legendary animals, that you can unlock the legendary panther. That's, I think, it's in around Braithwaite Manor, if I remember. Um. But yeah, I've never, I've never unlocked that, so... I've got a dead beaver. No, that's not a euphemism for something. Okay, let's take a look at it. Once in a lifetime, eh? Quality hide makes the hardiest clothes around. Don't doubt it. Um. Thank you kindly. Okay. Thank you. Really. Tailored saddles made to measure. Look no further. Yeah, I'm not trying to be a knuckle for anybody. No. I'm just myself, so. Yeah. So far. <laughs> Funny way to kind of introduce yourself into the stream, so. Easy. Whoa. Yeah, if if possible, no aggro, please. Um, that's not my vibe. Well, that was unfortunate.
Alright. I'm gonna try and see where this moose is. I know it's up around about Randy Wine. How many have I killed so far in the game queue? Um like in this playthrough? Um well, I've got two so far. Um But in the past I know I've got I've killed the deer quite a few times, the bear, um the bison up in the mountains, the fox, that turkey there. <laughs> Um, hi Wayne, welcome on in. Um, I've not actually got a lot of the legendary animals in the past. I would always just get distracted by the game in general, so. But like, no word of a lie, I've only ever really seen a moose twice in this game from the times that I've played it. Yep. Oh, we're doing grand, Wayne. How was your weekend, Wayne? I'll oh, say I've tried I've tried playing playing online. I'm not very good at the online part. I don't really have the patience to kind of grind at it. Um, it's kind of a shame because I think like most people regarding um, the online version, there's a lot that could have been done um, in terms of content. So I've never really hung about too long in the in the online section. Right. Where's the moose? The moose, the moose. We got a tree. Get a got tree root. Get a tree root. I'm in cover. Now. Here's hoping. <laughs> here, here's hoping the moose that I'm tracking down doesn't just randomly die. Like, uh, like what happened in Paddy's stream. Uh, I'm not sure if there's a Halloween pass. I... I think there... There's going to be something. But, um, I don't think there is. I think they've just... Released a, a lot of aesthetic things in it. Um, but I'm... I'm not sure. I don't, I don't play a lot of online to... To know that, so I don't, I don't really follow online anymore. Um, don't seem close. Mm. Right. And we're gonna try and get as many of them as we can. Um. Because, like I said, without giving spoilers away, um, we're kind of locked, region locked, with what we can get so far. Um, is that it there? That's an, that's, a, that's an elk. It's not what I'm after. That is not what I'm after. Close. 
Sure is. Oh, and you're scaring the moose away. No, no. Get the rifle. We got the moose. Hmm. To skin the moose. See, my one just didn't drop and die. <laughs> That's one put up a little bit of a fight, so... Oh, uh, see... The story mode for this one is, in my opinion, better than online. But obviously I know people have got, people have got their opinions about that kind of thing. But... You get more out of story mode, I reckon, than you do in online. Um, online is very limited, at least in... Red Dead Online. Um, see, the way the way I see it is, I don't know if I would be able to justify paying like full price for a game to then only play the online section. Because I mean, I know you could buy, I know you could buy the two separate now, um, but. It's almost a bit of a, it's almost like a bit of a disservice to the game really if you're if you're gonna pay full price for something and then only play a half of it. Just And you're missing out on a lot of really great great missions and great moments and I almost went over the cliff. Dougal, what are you trying to do to me? beaver and we've got the boar. Well, I think the one after this, the closest one is gonna be the bear, I think. Is that the naked wolf man again? Okay, to go, it's fine. Oh, we've got more, uh, more Just pals, though. Minute, more pals that we can give back to the trapper. That's cool.
Hi, Cooper. Welcome on in. Just hunting some legendary animals. Let's go, boy. We've just got the moose. And we're heading back to the trapper to unload. Unload some of our kills. I think we're going to go after the bear next. I think that's the closest one on the map. Um, that one. back again. Yep. Ooh, three perfect wolf pelts. Nice. I like. Nothing quite like wearing your best day's work. They have to move away and then. Thanks, partner. Yeah. Ugh, the state, my gun. Ew. And yes, I go for the most basic of the guns. <laughs> yeah, I take Arthur as an no frills kind of man, so that's that's why I keep them fairly basic. Right, let's see. Um Let's go and get the bear. Take 
Yeah. How's your weekend been anyway, retrack of kinda of forgot to ask unless I've asked before. I'm a bit scatterbrained, so I do apologize. Trying to mark me? You trying to rob me? Nah, not happening. You don't try to outlaw an outlaw. So, Dougal. Where were we? Oh yeah, we were gonna go hunt a bear. We were through this way with Jose, remember? But we uh, decided to stay behind. We, no, we decided to go back with Jose. See, because he was hiding right behind these rocks. I think that way as well, um, Chris, sometimes. You know, it's... You, you, you might pick up some, some decent things, so that's, that's why I tend, that's why I tend to do it. So I'm a bit of a, bit of a magpie like that. Here we are. Yeah, still a ways. Bear shit. Must be near. Oh, I think I see him. Yep, there he is. He's like, I remember you from last time. Back again, I see. I did it. 
I killed it. Ew, look at it. Look at the bulb. <laughs> look at ooh. That's just gross. <laughs> that was easy. <laughs> I'm getting half mauled, I suppose. Sleep. Arthur sleep for the night. Consult the map. Wait, hang on. Um, head back down to the trapper again. So we can unload go, boy. this pelt. Yep. Just freeze up the the back of the horse because I'm not sure if because there's two that I know that are relatively close by. There's the well, we're going to go after the wolf and the elk. Now I'm guessing the elk's going to be a pretty big pelt, so I need to free up space on my horse for that. So nice to see you again, Wayne. Welcome back. You have not missed much, you've just killed a bunch of animals. 
just got I just got the beer. Um, I don't know, like when when you get that mission early on in the game to go hunt the bear with Hosea, I tend and Hosea gives you the option at the end. Do you want to, you know, stay and go after the the bear, or do you want to head back to camp? I usually head back to camp. Um, it's like Arthur and his dad, so I'm like, no. I wouldn't want Jose to be on his own. I mean, he could look, clearly look after himself. I'm not saying he can't, but you know, spend time with Jose, have a gab on the way back. Good to see you again. All right, let's have a look. Boy, the things I can make with this. All made to measure. There. What do you think? <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. I have what I need for that. a unique garment, you need to bring me a unique belt. It'll be worth it. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna go back <laughs> looking like that with a, with a with a big bear hat. Springs, because I know the elk is around Cumberland Forest, so I think we'll go after the wolf first. Because the wolf one's fairly, fairly easy, and if I remember rightly, we started on one of the treasure maps, and the second part of the map is at Katora Springs, around where the legendary wolf is because I know the final like the location of the, the treasure is in it's in the little islands by um, Ukraine's run which is uh, fairly handy Do go. Ugh. 
looks like a <laughs> looks like a hit and run. I think I killed about four deer there. <laughs> Come on, Diggle. Come on. Another time. Next time, friend. Next time we'll get you. You can write that down. Bye now. Yeah. Okay. Easy. Hmm. I wonder. What's up here? It's like an interesting view. Oh, oh my god, just look at that view. God, this game is just so beautiful. Can't. Yeah, we didn't have to go race with that guy, but yeah, I wanted to. I can remember, I can remember racing somebody once, and I think it was one one of my first early playthroughs. Um, wasn't streaming it at the time, um, but yeah, my my horse decided to hunt me over a cliff mid-race so that was fun <laughs> uh, safe to say I lost the race and I was human <laughs> stats just want to double check he's fine
Oh god. Oh, Stay here, boy. some ground to cover. Oh, I do love this part of the map though, with the geysers and, oh. Perfect pelts, but but we've got the legendary, so that's something. Now I think we can try and go for the because you see the cairns over in the distance. Well, one of the clues. From the, I think it's the Jack Hall gang map. Easy, um, boy. The treasure map done. we got way at the start. Well, the second, the second clue is in one of those cairns. I forget which one. Um, but then it leads to the, the final part of that map and it tells us where 
where it is, basically. I know I didn't necessarily have to skin it, but I I did, so <laughs> it's fine. It's just the geyser, Dougal. It's just the geyser. It's fine. Easy, easy. Right, dig in. Go to the trapper down here. Because we're on that path. I think it's this one. this one. Yep, yeah. that's Okuri's run. There's a little island in the middle of the pond in Okuri's run. Come on now, boy. Yep. Get that another time, though. At least they don't tell you to go hunt a hunt a legendary cougar in this game, though, Chris. <laughs> I won't say that. Because I think we got ambushed by one on the last stream. Um, from what I from what I remember, <laughs> I think we were around about where the mad professor is. Um, and it just linked itself out through the trees and thankfully I spotted it in time because you can't say that often happens I didn't take anything. I brought. I didn't take anything. Hey, this is a big mistake. You forget what you saw right now. Don't make this difficult. You goddamn hearing me? Get away! Yeah. I just had a look in your basket, mate. I didn't steal anything. I could have done. I could have took your brandy, but then I didn't take your brandy, bro. <laughs>
Yeah, I would say this is like my favorite part of the map. You know, there's... You're out in the country, you're out in the hills, prairies. Come back this way. Ooh. So I need to drop this off first. I think the most terrifying encounter I've had in terms of the wildlife in this game was I was up around Blackbone Forest because um, there's a trapper up that way um, and funnily enough I was at the trapper and then suddenly out of nowhere a grizzly bear pounced on me um, and then I shoot and kill it as you do but it's what happened next which made me laugh was the, the, the trapper took a very bad overreaction to the whole situation and suddenly um, it was like the what the wanted sign came up uh, uh, and the like trapper was running and away, running away screaming black gun I'm gonna get the law and it's like bro I was defending myself it's like bro you saw you saw the you saw the grizzly you saw it what do you want me to do? Now, you're gonna have an ambush. Keep your gun on. Boys, who do you think you're fooling? I didn't even blink. That was stone cold. <laughs> stone cold. Arthur was like, nah. They're trying to take my wolf pelt. <laughs> the bastards. I know where I am now. And the trapper is just on the top of this hill. Take a look at it. Quality hide makes the hardiest clothes around. Don't doubt it.
master of this stolen toad than you or anyone can with nothing but a horse and a saddle. It's not about speed. These days I'm fishing more and tracking less. My old man was right. Sneaks up on you. Right. Go back up to cat sale. Thank you kindly. More distals. My camp now. Get damn dirty Adriscos. Fact. I'm uh, I'll do something. I'm gonna have ourselves a little, little bonfire.
Ooh, blew his leg off. Nice. Right. Gonna have ourselves a bonfire. This is what we do after we murder those goals in this game. Founder Lens, Founder Lens. Lights coming through the trees. Oh, I love it. Easy. All right. We're gonna get our thirty salt for the night. Yeah, we're gonna go back to Cattail and get the. I think it's the legendary ram. Um, God. Ah! No, 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 we're not doing that, Dougal. Yeah. <laughs> Hell no. You're not taking me off cliffs, Dougal. Yeah. 
Easy now. That check. Okay. Okay. Trail. Big horn ram, Trail that's what it is. Looks a way off. Must be near.
Got it. Back to the trapper again. Yeah, there's there's a lot of back and forth when you're when you're doing this. Oh. Appaloosas. I love Appaloosas. They're such beautiful horses. Appaloosas are such beautiful horses. I love them. Oh. I know, I was thinking that deer almost like ran me up the back end. Half, <laughs> something like that did happen on my original Let's Play over on the Around the Campfire podcast channel. Um, and I wasn't even doing anything. That's the funny thing about it. Um, I remember I was looking at the Register Rock out in the Heartlands. And then out of nowhere, Bambi just comes up and rams me up the ass. Completely random. Like, completely unprovoked. It's like one of the funniest moments in that... in that Let's Play. Don't miss much, Keel. You gotta help me out here, mister. Can you? Please. I've been on the run for days now. Uh, if you could help me with these shackles, I, I just might have a chance. So how'd you end up like this? Just shoot the damn chains already. Come on. Is enough? Oh. oh, oh, yes. Yes! Perfect! Ah, thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you, mister. I'm afraid I don't have anything to offer you except my gratitude. You're a good man. Thank you. That's all right. Just go find yourself a new change of clothes. I'd keep low I was you. Yeah, you got that right. Yeah. No, just, uh... Managed to go after some of the the legendaries. I think the next one after this will be the elk. So I want to say the elks are in around Cumberland Forest, um, and we're not too far away from that area. Um, but it's just been a lot of yep. track down the animal, kill it. Take it back to the trapper. Yeah. We've not done any of the fish yet, though. But 
I think I said, like, in regards to the fish, that would be a lower priority. Hello, shopkeep. Right, let's have a look. Me again. Oh, I'd pay just about any price for this. All made to measure. See, all of this is just for more, like, aesthetic, really. Um... I think it's more so as well if you want to go for, like, 100% or Been something. the ridge west of Annisburg. Good hunting. You meet a falconer named Jerry. Tell him I said hi. Uh, okay, I'll bear that in mind. If I see Jerry, I'll say hi. Like sometimes part of the legendary animals makes up for Dakota, some of the tall trees, big valley, Roanoke. I run this stall just about everywhere. Best way to source the skins. Right. But then again, I think I'm keeping the guy in business, so... East of Bacchus Station is where the elk is. Alright. So around here. <clears throat> I'm gonna fast travel to Valentine. So, so far we've got the beaver, the grizzly bear, the bighorn ram, the boar, the moose, the wolf, um, and we're gonna go after the elk, and then it'll be the white bison, then the buck, and then the coyote and the fox. I'm trying to go in the area that we're in, like start from because we were in the mar, we were in the marsh area, so taking us up around that part of the map, and then come back down into the mine again. Oh. Now you see, Helen, Acri here is a silly boy, and Protus isn't a boy at all, but a chimpanzee that a man shaves up face into every day. Now that's very useful if you need to climb a tree, but a good conversationalist it does not make. He was always a sickly child, sickly and weird. You can't punch, my sweet. It's sad, really. Oh my, our friend. Hello. I bet <laughs> you can punch. Do me and the lady a favor here, would you? And thrash this impudent wretch. Thrash? No man alive can thrash me. What was your name, sir? Arthur. Arthur could. Easily. <laughs> you, maybe, but not me. 
I know. Punch us both as hard yeah, at least as you sure. can. You'll break <laughs> his glass jaw, and I'll be left standing. The knight and the knave. Good idea. Hit me then, dear boy. Give the feeble fellow a little tap and watch him crumble. Huh? Uh... Come on. Ow. <laughs> you really walloped him. Right, yikes. I'm fine. Come on. Ooh, look there. I got a proper chin. Not like that toe rag. Good lord above. <laughs> Doesn't hurt. Oh. Hey, hey, hit, hit me, me again. again. Right here. Right here. You want me? Oh. Weren't you taught never to hit girls? Punch a man for once. Give me your worst. Here I oh. I think he's done for. Barely even felt it. Oh, there's only one thing for it, Dad. Hit me in the manhood. You want kids, right? Don't worry, sir. Mine are made of steel. Real steel. Really? Oh, <laughs> right in the shoot, Lisa. <laughs> they come out his ears. <laughs> My turn. <sighs> oh, right in the dick. <laughs> yes, I think so. Oh, I slipped, and I hope you killed the leprechaun. But he's still alive. Shoot him, please, one of you. There, there, up you get. We need to get some steak on those wounds. Madam, which one? Gentlemen, good luck to you. Whatever got into your heads? <laughs> it's like Arthur's little laugh. It's like so adorable. All right. Hello, Mister. I'm gonna do a uh, stop off in the general store. Hello. Come on in. I saw you eyeing the liquor as you walked in. You know what you like. Don't judge Some me. Some things all along the shop and on the counter if you want something to pair it with. Mm. I need some coffee. Hit them with a shovel. Your yeah, Arthur would be like, yeah, don't tempt me. Do not tempt me. It's corn. Oh, Miss Hardshaw, the seamstress passed away. Don't know who's gonna mend my things now. Maybe you mend your own things. Is available for purchase. Thank you. Alright. 
Low key then. Okay. Keep looking. Let me know if there's anything else. Thanks, partner. Excuse me. Oh! I was got kicked by another random horse. He better get his act together. You got a problem. Alright. We're gonna go and get the elk. <clears throat> I think the sides and the guide is just east of Bacchus Station. Yeah. Check of the stats. It goes fine. Grant. Help a blind a man. man. Not seen this guy in a while. Be a fool for love. Help a blind man. Have this. I've not seen him in a while. Your father is seduced by the one with the forked tongue. It's no use hoping. Ha uh ha. -huh. That prophecy. Oh, I love it. Your father is seduced by the one with the forked tongue. Ooh, I wonder who he's talking about. I think there's another one that he says where he says something like, All your life you've been following the wrong star. Or something along those lines. Rub myself down with uh, some cover scent.
Oh, is that a moose? Oh my god, it's a moose! There's some moose loose about this house. <laughs> right. I think I need to... Here we go. Here we go. This could take a while. Well, I hear the elk. Don't know if it's that specific elk, but... Still a ways. 
Getting close. I did it. If it would let me, come on. Here we go. Some of these animations are just brutal. <laughs> so I think it's safe to say um might not be doing the fishing this time round. That might be a, a separate stream. Um Up the elk? I don't think I can. It's just a waste. Just... Hey, boy. All right. I think that's the nearest. Trapper. Yep. Hey. Is that your blood? Yeah, I just killed an elk, dude. It is my blood. This game is just beautiful, Whoa, isn't it? Easy. Yep. Yeah, cool. I'd be I'd be up for that. How how are you gonna go about doing that? Are you gonna be streaming it or how how are you gonna do that? How are you getting on with the that wee laser? And doing like your your craft kind of stuff. I mean, I know Sarah's been posting stuff on it as well, and some of the stuff you've been making is really good. All on Discord, right? Okay. Yeah. I might swing by. Oh, look at these colors. As the sun's going down in the game, just ah, uh, this game is just so pretty. Oh, that's good to hear, Kyo. Yeah. Have he's like set up an Etsy shop or something?
He's thinking of setting up a website or that queue with uh with your wee business. More dead animals. Look no Welcome back, sir. You play oh, you again. Okay, let's take a look at it. <laughs> Boy, the things I can make with this. Nothing quite like wearing your best day's work. Thanks, Mister. Say it like you mean it, mister. Glow? Yeah. Right. Okay, so <clears throat> to recap, we've done the beaver, the bear, the bighorn ram, the boar, the elk, the moose, the wolf, um, Why don't we go the bison? Go for the, the white bison. Now that's up in the mountains, if I remember rightly. In fact, I know it's up in the mountains. Um, so we'll just fast travel. We'll fast travel up to Coulter.
I remember. It's down around Lake Isabella. I'll just get the precise location. So it's in and around here. Not too far away. I love, I love this part of the map. I love like, like the snow and just. I am a sucker for good weather, weather mechanics in this game. I just love it. Yeah. It's just so pretty. find the White Arabian in around Lake Isabella as well. <clears throat> so up now. Yeah. I mean, I don't know about you, but anytime you see like large plains of untouched snow, I think everybody's okay. first reaction is to go run in it. I know mine does. <laughs> They're sliding about on the on the on the ice. It looks so cute. We gotta show you. I know one of the legendary the fishes up here as well. I think it's the legendary salmon. If I remember. Must be close. <gasps> I think I see it. I see it. I see it.
There it is. Oh, there's the White Arabian. Where are you going? Got a cold ass war. Let's go find the the White Arabian Wars. We can catch it and then stable it. We've got a standby horse. Come back here, or see. I'm a back. Try that again. Shh, easy now. It's okay. Stay calm. Easy now. Easy. Yeah. Easy, easy. Easy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Easy, easy horse. Hey. Ah. Ah. Uh, okay. Oh, 
Okay then. Feisty. You feisty. Okay. Okay. You feisty. I see. Hey, stop! No, no, wait. Hey, wait, where are you going? Spicy. I'm almost getting snow snow blindness because of this. Arthur's just having no luck at all. You stubborn hun. I'm so ill-equipped for running about in the snow! Ah! You are a feisty one. No, no, stay here! No, no, wait! Hey, stop! Whoa, whoa, wait! Oh, wait. Okay, ah, come on. Go easy. 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 Whoa. Easy there. Yeah, we're okay now. Whoa now. Hey now. Oh, I did it. We're good. I tamed her. Girl. Good girl. Ah. You doing good, girl. Ah, I did. Thank you, Arthur. <laughs> gonna come through the trees, and Diggle's gonna be like, "Huh, I see how it is. You replaced me. I haven't replaced Diggle." I haven't. Diggle will always be my... Diggle will always be my horse. Diggle is my horse. Um...
I think. What should we what should we call this horse? What should this horse's name be? I'm thinking, I don't know, hmm, I need to think. actually done a playthrough run with an Arabian. Still gonna have Doug Dougal is my still gonna be my horse though. Um Cores are down, and I know why that is because I'm not wearing appropriate winter garb. That's why I came yep. unprepared for the weather. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, I'll probably pick a name like I don't know, Morag or something. <laughs> yeah. I want to pick an interesting name though. I always do. I always do that with my horses in this game. I like to give them kind of almost unique kind of names. Yeah. I mean, there was one save file that I've got. Um, I've got a Mustang, and he's called Sundance. Why is there singing to himself? I'm gonna stay. I'm gonna stable this horse. Um, I know what that stranger mission's indicating, but I'll go to that at some point before. But I've not. Oh. Back. Nope. I don't care at this stage. I need to stable this horse. I'm stabling this horse first. Because I don't want to do it and then potentially lose the horse. So... Come on, do go catch up. Come on. <laughs> yep.
<laughs> yeah, kind of got sidetracked <laughs> trying to get the White Arabian. Wow. Ow. Because they say that <coughs> aesthetically the White Arabians are, you know, beautiful horses. And they are, like, the, one of the fastest in the game. That's a, what are you doing? However, they say that they're very very um skittish they get scared easy i mean they're fine i suppose but you know We've got Philippa there. Um, it's not stolen. I'll get you switched out. Default name for the moment. Um. Hold on a minute. Um, default name at the moment. You spell it. Marjorie. <clears throat> That's horse. That's it's gold, Marjorie. Marjorie means uh, peril. So, Let's but like I said, we're uh, sticking to Dougal. Dougal's our boy. He has been since. Mm -hmm. <coughs> I mean, I know his stats are a lot lower compared to Marjorie, but he's my boy. Can't get rid of him. We've got Philippa there, Marjorie, and Dougal. Enjoy. Bring that horse back if you need anything. No. There's a trapper up along this way. So we'll drop that off so we can get the, the legendary buck.
Need a ride? I can get you there. Ow! Ow. Toggle. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh, I killed the horse. Man, I'm so sorry. Oh, the poor horse. Tickle. Oh, fuck's sake. Oh, the poor horse. Oh, damn it, Jacob. <laughs> Poor thing. That horse was one day away from retirement. This isn't necessarily the. Oh, oh, fish, huh? Well, I suppose. I mean. Poor horse, though. Felt so bad. Oh, oh, I got you. I got you. Please be the special fish. Or no.
Damn. Oh, you are one fine fish, my There's friend. the legendary fish. You're a fine bass. What are you? No, a small mouth. Yeah, you can stay. Wait. Just gonna have to run back to town. <laughs> Wait, swap. Well. Right. I'm going to have to run. To turn to run back to strawberry. <clears throat> Again, taking a wee bit of a detour, but we did say that we were going to get some of the legendary fish, and we did. Caught the the bass. I know. Horse. <coughs> I'm still sad about that. <laughs> right, so, when we get to town, we're going to go to the post office, <coughs> post the fish, and then put the pelt back on. On Dogiel's Park and then head to the Trapper. I oh, don't say that, Q. <laughs> something. I think something similar happened last time I caught the legendary bass or one of the big fish um, on Lake Olingila. It was either a musky, I think it was a musky. Or the bass, I forget which one. <coughs> Ow! Oh, shit. Fucking muskrat! Distracting me there. I lost my train of thought there. Fucking hell. Something fucking bit me. Ow! But yeah. <clears throat> Same thing happens. I was like. I think I had a wolf pelt on, on my back or something. 
I had a pelt of some kind on on my shoulder. Um, <laughs> and I proceeded to run up a hill, not realizing it was a cliff, and then I ended up somersaulting right off the off the side of the cliff. Yeah, and I died. So I suddenly like forced got there. It something bit me. <laughs> what are you waiting for? <laughs> oh. I've been called many things, but I've never been called for a scum before, so that made me laugh. <laughs> I'll give you that, Chris. <laughs> something oh, jumped up and uh, bit me. Look away. Ow. Not again, you filthy pervert! Me! Have an eye full oh. of this! Oh, shit! Ah, oh, for fuck's sake! No! Ugh, I may have deserved oh, God, that. Please help me! Where's my fish? Where'd the fish go? Where's my fish? Where's my fish? Where's my fish? Where's my fish? Ah! <laughs> For not lost the fucking fish. Sake. Better not lost the fucking fish. I swear to God. I swear to God. Yep. Some bastard better not come along and went, oh, that's a big fish. <clears throat> Bastards. Better not take my fish. Oh no. Thank fuck. There it is. There it is. Oh. <coughs> Thank God, I found it. <laughs> it's, I've got a cure. It's here. <laughs> so the blind panic there and gone, no, after all that, I better not lost the fucking fish. <laughs> Hello. I'd like to post one fish, please. Hey there. You Hector? That's me. Alden tells me you're a discouraged man. Ah, you must be a friend of that Josiah Trelawney. All right, in that case, I've got something here you might want to take a look at. Mm-hmm. <laughs> here. There's a stage heading up from Blackwater. Mm -hmm. Now, I hear it'll be heavily guarded, so you might want to try a more covert approach. Or lay down some explosives. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> You're the expert. Thank you, Hector. Appreciate it. You enjoy the rest of your day. All right. Suit yourself. Now, can I pose my fish? I want, I want to post the fish. <clears throat> I 
Thank you. There's 13 of them. Jesus. Come on, pal. No. <coughs> I think Arthur deserves a bath and a proper bed. I need a bath. That's okay. Can you organize? All right. Head on over when you're ready. Because he's been out and out and about for so long. I don't know. I mean, I thought the catfish was um, <coughs> part. <coughs> sorry, <coughs> I thought the legendary catfish was like part of the. It was part of the co content, or something. Or I might be. I might be wrong. Don't quote me on that. After we've had Arthur have some sleep, we're going to go to <coughs> the Trapper, right about Blackbone Forest, and then whilst we're in that area, we're going to go for the legendary Buck as well, because that's in that area. Um, And then head back to the roads area because let me just double check to see what I've got so far to what I can get so far. Um, so we've got the beaver, the bear, the bighorn ram, the boar, the elk, the moose, the wolf, the white bison. Um, and yeah, we'll go get the coyote. After we get the buck, we'll go get the the coyote and the fox. And then the bull alligator. And then, unfortunately, we're unable to progress anymore with the, the other the other ones. What is wrong with you? Yes, I did it. <laughs> you got a problem with me? No, I don't have a problem. Hey, partner. Yeah, I think the trapper is up about this way. All right, what, what's the... You ain't right, is you? Out of the damn way! The hell's your problem? Hey there, I'll drive you wherever you need to go. Yeah. Hmm. 
Yeah, I think we've made... <clears throat> I think we've made a fair bit of progress. Clean this gun. Yep. Yeah, the thing about this part of the map <coughs> is cougars and bears. The middle of the road. Hey, you there? Hi. Hi. Do you mind watching my stuff while I head to find another wagon? Ah, I don't like seeing such things. Uh, sure. You're a kind man. I'll be back. Fit as a fiddle. Boss ain't gonna be happy about this. I'll be amazed if you make it to tomorrow. You're a goddamn mess. Hmm. Aww. A lot of moonshine. Everything's distracting me. <laughs> I just want to go the trapper. Stuff keeps distracting me. God damn it. <clears throat> focus. I need focus. <clears throat> Oh, I think I see the trapper. Right up along here. Me again. Hello. So, buying or selling? <clears throat> what are you buying? Let's have a look. 
Oh, I'd pay just about any price for this. <laughs> Quality hide makes the hardiest clothes around. Don't doubt it. Right. <clears throat> Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, you all right there, boy? What happened to the white horse? I stabled it. I did. I called the the Arabian Marjorie. This Marjorie is <clears throat> means peril. Ah, there it is. Must be close.
I'm just skin it first. Just give me a minute, boy. Yep. At least, at least the trapper's not too far away on this side of the map. Okay, let's take a look at it. Once in a lifetime, eh? All made to measure. No. The next one will be the coyote, or the coyote, as the Americans call it, and the coyote is around here. And then the fox is here. Because I think we'll do the coyote, the coyote, then the fox, and then head into the trapper at Saint Denis. Drop that off, and then we'll find where the bull gator is. And then we'll have essentially done all the um, legendary animals that, at this point of the game, we've got access to. Because, like I said, like I said, without giving too many spoilers away, um, the others are map um, specific, <coughs> and we've only got um, certain access at the moment of the map. So it's just a shame, but eh, it is what it is.
there a moment. Move out of the darn way! Dang it! Oh no, Wayne, someone broke your fence. Try this town's wine or women? Or just whatever's cheapest. What is it with the men around here? I'd head out full chiseled if I was you, lest you want to be shot to death by raiders. Excuse me? Cool. Just about done with you! Ah. Ow! I can skip. You're already <laughs> Sweet heaven! Bitch! You missed Finish your target, safe, boys! What? Shy. Hey! This! This here's the feller! The one that found me. <laughs> this feller? You let him suck on your leg? <laughs> <laughs> I will owe you my whole life. No lie. But uh, let, me, let me buy you something from the store. Whatever you want, it's on it's me. <laughs> oh, thank you. Okay. Appreciate it. Having conquered evil the if way I, I have, yours, it's the least a humble man can do. What can I do for you? The, uh, yeah, well, guy with the snake bite says right. I can put some here on his tab. That fool? Yeah, yeah. Jesus. If it's not one thing, it's another with him. But he pays his old, so who am I to argue? Let me know what you choose. I'll add it to his list. I don't think he could buy a gun. Because <coughs> it's, the, it's the general store that the guy's talking about. I'll let him know. I'll You're just get some next time, though. Some cocaine. <laughs> just bought some cocaine. Some cocaine gum. Pick something up on your tab. Thanks again. Good luck to you. Thank you. Dead looking like that. Oh, there's the fence as well. Because when you get the legendary animals, you can get the trinkets as well. I think you better leave. You turn your tail and get. I've gone to the. I'm going to the fence, bruh. Well, long time no see, stranger. <laughs> Alright, so I'm keeping the Reutlinger, the gem, the Native American ring, the fertility statue. Ooh, <coughs> there's a Landon Ricketts card, I'll keep that. I'll keep some things. Landon Ricketts, Black Bell, keep, keep.
Bu da epic normal. In a minute, sift through, see what you like. Looking for a special something for a special someone? Beautiful, just a second. I trust nobody's missing. Yeah. Just come back tomorrow if you need anything, all right? Yeah, I know, like, cert certain items, it's like, um, like, chains and stuff like that. <laughs> that I know that you can get, like, with, um... Like, when you do, when you do like, certain, certain requests. Um... Minty mutton. Right. We'll go up and get the coyote. I know it's around Dewberry Creek.
Yeah, apologies if I go quiet, I just get distracted. <clears throat> And I just, uh, I get focused, or I, or I try to. Let's see what we got. This could take a while. to the ways. Here we are. Funnily enough, I had a lot of issue with this one originally. I don't know why. Yeah. I think when I was first playing it though, I didn't really, you know, have a understanding of the the hunting mechanics in the game, so I think that's why I struggled. thinking the fast travel is San Denis unload it to the trapper and then head back to Rhodes and then get the fox and then I think once we get the fox, then we'll go for the the, the alligator. Thank you. 
this check. I think we've made clear progress. Um, I think when it comes to kind of like the the legendary fish, though, um, I think that may be a separate stream. Probably have to save that for another time, though. Cause that that takes time. That'll Whoa, take time. You look where you're going. Again. All right, let's have a look. Me again. <laughs> oh, I'd pay just about any price for this. Nothing quite like wearing your best day's work. I've run this stall all the way from here to the border. The northern border, that is. And I've never been out of work. Thank you. Bye. Back to back to roads. Hey, I wanna move. I wanna be bougie. Besides I need to pick up the meal anyway. Last see you again, sir. Hmm. Thank you. Thank you. Really? <laughs> Can I get a ride, please, partner? Where should I point the horse? Roads, please. No destination too close. That's my motto. Good morning to you. Right. Well, here we are. And my ass isn't too flattened either. Huh. All the best. And now the fox. <clears throat> you have made a fair bit of progress on this. What the hell's your problem? My boy. Dougal is the best boy. He's a dumbass, but we love him. We wouldn't have Dougal any other way. Whoa. Now, the fox is in this wooded bit, I remember. I remember finding this one a little bit annoying because uh, 
it's a fox it's gonna be fairly small compared to some of the other ones ah yeah Here we are. Fuck shit. Got some ground to cover. be a way off. Must be near. Got it. I just murdered a whole bunch of like unique animals that are unique to their ecosystem. Now they're just like, ooh, pelts. <laughs>
All right, so we're going to fast travel back again to Sandini. Um, again, go to the trapper, unload the fox, and then we're going to go and do our last one of the night. We're going to go back and finish off that big bull gator. Quality hide makes the hardiest clothes around. Don't doubt it. Can't get a lick on us, work. All these damn fauners coming through. Mm. Good choice. Maybe if I be my You must have heard of Tatanka, the buffalo down in Hennigan'sted. Big as a stagecoach and twice as hard to kill. Safe travel. Okay, fella. Hello. Right. I just need to go and look and see where the location for the bull gator is. Oh, I can't get it yet. The gate says after chapter 5 and we're still in chapter 4. Oh, that sucks. Oh well. Well, let's head back to camp. Take a seat. Only a trim or something fancy like? It's 
So yeah, we've uh All right. You ready to go. Thanks, partner. I think once we get into chapter 5, we'll get the bull gator. Um I think I think what we'll do in that instance is we'll get We'll go after the bull gator and and the fish in that in that one stream. That's my plan. That's my plan. In fact, I suppose. We've still got a little bit of time. Um, there is one legendary fish that we can get. It's relatively close by. This could work. Come on. I'll just try. That's you. All right. Yeah, you can stay. Yeah. So dump this fish. Four solvers and then we'll head back to camp. 
And I think that will be us for the night. But we've made a, <coughs> a lot of good progress. It's just a shame that it has to be after chapter 5 to get the build gear, but... Good to see you again, mister. What would you like to send? This fish. Thank you. Thank you. Now, camp. So, Ooh. bitch. Sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No? No newspapers? Hello. Alms for the blind. You try, my friend. I'll sleep well tonight. Yeah, we've done good progress. <clears throat> Got the majority of the animals that were available. Yep. And we'll pick up the rest another time. Yeah. It's a shame we couldn't get all of them, but you know. I can't do anything about it. Hey, who's that? Arthur! Dumbass! Good to see you back, Arthur. I love that. Arthur, you dumbass. Whoa! Need to check and see tobacco. Whoa there. Easy. Easy. I know you don't like me, tobacco. Whoa now. Another day down. Hosea. You're looking good? Thank you. Good to see. Thanks. There's ghosts in your head, Reverend. Ghosts! Ghosts! I saw a ghost! A young woman! You've lost your mind. You poor bastard. Jack! Where is he? 
Mr. Pearson, have you seen Jack? Mm, no. Nobody always turns up. He's a smart kid. I hope so. Jack! Jack! Where are you, son? I'm getting real worried. Maybe if you kept an eye on your kid, he wouldn't keep wandering off. That kid. Do you blame him for running off? <laughs> Guess not. Just like his dad. <laughs> Just like his dad. Evening. Hey there. Oh, Arthur, I can't believe those pigs did that to him. You can. He was such a gentle soul. Yeah, he saved my life one time. I'll miss him. You make the bastards pay, Arthur. If we get the chance, we surely shall. Oh. Haven't well. received anything uh. from you in a while, Mr. Morgan. Well. Yeah, I will. This will help the stew. I brought a whole lot. Can't wait to taste this. Many thanks, Mr. Morgan. You well? And I'm going to call it there for a night because we've been going since five o'clock and it's now at the time of this recording about seven minutes past ten at night so yes <laughs> I'm gonna call it there um yeah we did fairly well on that <coughs> like I said it's a shame that we couldn't get them all but you know circumstance but I think when once we've entered chapter five um we will continue with going after the bull gator and getting as many of the legendary fish as possible maybe not necessarily all of them but some of them at least um but um yeah and we might get the i know i want to do the rock carvings but i might save that for another time um i don't know yet <coughs> but no, but I know next for the next stream we will be continuing on the story mode, and yeah, I think the story is kind of taking a turn for the worst just now. Hmm. Well, what's the saying? You can only go from bad to worse. So, yeah, it's buckle up and uh, yeah, be ready. For those for those that for those that know what I'm talking about, yeah, don't want to give too much away, but but yeah, thanks for everybody who joined in, um, for anybody for anybody that popped in to say hello, um, and if you haven't done so already, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to Tartan Hobbit, um, and also share the channel with your friends, co-workers, family. Anybody who might be interested <coughs> in watching my chaos unfold. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Thanks so much for watching. Stay tuned for, for more coming up. Because it's going to be... It's going to be a doozy. Ooh. And I can't wait for this chapter. I can't wait for chapter 5. I can't wait, I can't wait for the... I can't wait for the upcoming chapters. <laughs> It says a sarcasm. You'll see soon. See why. <clears throat> or for those that do know, you understand. You you know where I'm coming from. <laughs> but with that being said, thanks so much for watching, and I will see you all next time. Bye for now.